For many years, Japanese role-playing games, or JRPGs, have captured the hearts and imaginations of players all around the world. There's something special about these story-driven, immersive adventures that make players want to keep playing. I'll go into the reasons why I, along with a lot of other people, adore JRPGs. JRPGs have been a genre that I only have tapped into into recent years, but have slowly become my go-to genre, my bread and butter. Whenever I pick up one, I know I'll have a great time at least for the most part. JRPGs are a timeless source of delight and interest for a variety of reasons, including their captivating gameplay mechanics, unique art style, and rich plot. So today, I want to share with you why I love JRPGs. Hello everyone, my name is Fedro and this is Cozy Fudgy and on this channel we cover a variety of things such as video essays, reviews, JRPGs, and all things Cozy Gaming. Before we go into what I love about JRPGs, some may not know what a JRPG is. The definition of what a JRPG is different for many people. Throughout the years, the definition has changed and evolved many times. According to MediaWiki, JRPGs are typically made by Japanese developers, but not exclusively. Modern day makers of what classifies what a JRPG can be a variety of things, such as its art style that can come off as an anime-esque, but there are exceptions. Also many JRPGs today and in the past share many themes and tropes like amnesia, saving the world, a party that travels with you on your adventure, and you can't forget overly complicated plots. For me, JRPGs weren't a commonplace in my household. Whatever my brother played, I played, which meant a lot of platformers and action-adventure games. Games like Sly Cooper, Sonic Adventure, Ratchet and & Clank, and of course, any Super Mario game. I do remember hearing about JRPGs at the time, but not really knowing what they were called. A memory I can recall was watching a music video of Simple & Clean on Disney Channel. I remember loving the song and watching the Kingdom Hearts intro that played alongside it. Again, I didn't think much of it and went about my business. Also, I do remember when trailers for the new Final Fantasy game would be trending, whether that be a new trailer for about the launch of FF14 or a hype trailer for the announcement of the FF7 remake. I remember watching this and not really understanding the hype, but recognized that the work and graphics of these games looked cool. It won't be years later before my normie self re really acknowledges the greatness that JRPGs bring. I have mentioned this story many times on my channel, but the game that really introduced me to the genre was the Persona 5 anime. I remember watching the first episode and loving the premise, so I did more digging and found out it was based on a video game, so I went to YouTube and watched an entire walkthrough of the game like it was a TV show series. So I looked up other walkthroughs or let's plays of JRPGs and watched walkthroughs of Persona 4 Golden and Persona 3 Fest, as well as going back to Kingdom Hearts in its entirety. It won't be until 2020 where I got to experience a JRPG firsthand with Fire Emblem Three Houses. This game to me was so revolutionary. What drew me into this game was its three branching story paths. Each unfold and tell a unique aspect of the world it's set in with a fun-loving cast of characters that you will do anything for. Being able to play one route and unlock certain aspects of the story that not only add the, to the overarching one being told, it also gives you some easter eggs to get you to play the next one to find out what the true evil is at play in Holdland. I can sing Fire Emblem Three Houses praises for days, but what I can say is that the game really opened my eyes to a genre that I can call my favorite today. Now that we know the, what a JRPG is and my brief history with them, let's really get into what makes JRPGs so great. It goes without saying that JRPGs are known for their complex and immersive stories. They often feature well-developed characters and intricate plot lines and deep lore. Players can become emotionally invested in narrative, which can make the gaming experience highly engaging and memorable. JRPGs typically emphasize character development, both in terms of main protagonists and the supporting cast. Players often witness significant growth and evolution in the characters, making it easy to form strong connections with them. Character development stands as another pillar for JRPG narratives. Players forge deep connections with diverse multidimensional characters, each with their own histories, motivation, and growth arcs. These characters evolve through the game and creating emotional investment and a sense of shared experience. The relationships formed with the party members become crucial aspects of the player's journey, reinforcing the emotional resonance of the narrative. JRPGs often feature expansive and detailed gaming worlds for players to explore. These worlds are filled with interesting locations, hidden treasures, and diverse landscapes. 
The sense of discovery and exploration can highly be rewarding. Cherry BGs excel in constructing immersive and expansive worlds. The meticulous attention to detail and crafting intricate settings with the unique lore and culture sets the game apart. Environments are not just backdrops. They are integral components that enhance the narrative's richness. From the bustling cityscapes to the serene landscapes, every locale contributes to the overall tapestry of the story. JRPGs are known for their distinctive art styles, which often include colorful, imaginative character designs, unique settings, and visually stunning cutscenes. This artistic aspect can be visually pleasing and add to the overall enjoyment of the game. Many JRPGs feature iconic soundtracks composed by renowned musicians. The music can enhance the emotional impact of the story and create lasting impressions on the players. I feel like for me, music plays a huge impact and a huge part to making or breaking a game, especially games when I play Trails of the Sky whenever I'm in a certain forest and this the music comes into play. I totally get fully immersed or sometimes even distracted because of how good the songs are. You're even in Xenoblade Chronicles 3 when the Mobius theme kicks in and it really gets you going into what an amazing epic battle you're just about to come across. JRPGs often incorporate a variety of gameplay mechanics, including mini games, puzzles, and side quests. The diversity keeps the gameplay experience fresh and engaging. JRPGs often explore deep themes, including friendship, love, sacrifice, and the human condition. This emotional depth can resonate with players on a personal level, making the gaming experience more meaningful. Overall, JRPGs offer a unique blend of storytelling, character development, and gameplay mechanics that many gamers find appealing. Whether you're a fan of immersive narratives, strategic combat, or exploring richly crafted worlds, JRPGs has something to offer for a wide range of players. Just want to thank you guys so much for watching this video, and if you enjoyed what you watched, do not forget to hit that like and subscribe button. Also, comment down below, what is your favorite JRPG of all time? Again, thank you guys for watching and have a good one. Bye!